doesn't matter who is good or who's not because when you're playing smash online so true all right so looks like yep got the scoreboard correct i'll let you take it away cherry Alrighty, and uh, we're seeing the luigi interesting pick but i think just probably just has the matchup knowledge to back up playing against ness um ness is a character that when playing against luigi you really have to abuse Luigi when he's in the air. Luigi doesn't really do well against the, when he's in the air, unless he's the one like who got you there, like right there. Um, just kind of threw him, got enough throw. He's gonna wait out his side B there, using that uh, the down B here. It's a really good move. It actually activates on frame one, at which is essentially one of the quickest acting. It's the po quickest possible uh, a move can come out at. Um, on top of being the fastest, it also has armor, and it's a multi-hit, and it has a win box. So even if you run away from it last second, chances are you might get sucked into it. And I think Jest might be doing this maybe as a condition, maybe as a way to like kind of get into uh, Trail's head a bit. Um, we're kind of seeing it. I think that it definitely can be something that does that. Uh, so, because... Um, Luigi just has so many tools, like you're seeing this grab here, getting into that down B, ra just racking up percent, and uh, he's already about a lap him, I think, like, he's pretty much there. Watch out for that edge guard. Finally, the back throw. One of Ness's best moves, definitely, it's always been like that, um, with the really strong presence of back throw, but that was pretty cool to see. He um, used the down B at such a high point in the stage that you really can't DI anywhere. Um, and I think one thing that Jess or uh, Trell needs to do to kind of try and win his way back into this is just play a bit more patiently. Like, Luigi cannot really do anything too far away from you. If you see that he's trying to charge that neutral B, just wait, and if he does it, jump. He can't, it's not like he can, it's, he's not a heat seeking missile, he's just a green missile. He's gonna fly or at you and once you jump here oh so yeah so either condition you to jump or i'll come right at you and it is something that you have to be careful and like react i do it on reaction mm. and while it is online it's a bit harder to do just at the distance he just is trying to go for that app um i don't think it'll ever hit um pretty like often and we're kind of seeing Trell make his way back in this one. Like, he's at, only, he's at 83%, so he is at kill percent for Luigi. But I think that if he uses the right moves, like he's doing now... Ooh, that was okay. That, I think that's fine. You don't Used want to it to risk really kind of escape, yeah, instead of missing and then yes. being completely vulnerable. Yeah, I think that's a fine pick. Because even then, if... Uh, Jess gets confused by him just dropping it. He might try to go and attack and then get hit by it anyways. And um, now we're seeing him right there. Wow. Nice DI. Really good DI. Uh, Woo -hoo 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 -hoo! And there hey, for the people at home, make sure to clip that. That was so smart. He read how far he'd be away and also luck got a bit lucky for that. Uh, I don't know if you saw this yourself, but... When he got when he threw Luigi, um, Luigi also has a random chance of getting what's called like I think it's super missile or something. But essentially what that does is right I think here he gets the super move. So that basically sends him even farther. And so when Shrill noticed that he was like, oh you're just gonna fall right into my pocket. And so he charged that bat and hit him back like a baseball. <laughs> definitely hit a home run on that one. Oh definitely, I think that was probably the home run that we were looking for out of the park <laughs> but yeah I think I think uh, Trell really adapted at the end of that he was a bit impatient it might have just been nerves or something I know that that can definitely be a um, a thing that causes you to be a bit impatient or like almost twitchy but um, he really doubled down back and I think that the thing that uh, maybe won the pressure over for him and the momentum was just that up air that he got kind of near the end. Uh, just being in, put in a situation where you're dominating the whole game and then suddenly you're you're seeing the kill screen but you're the one dying for Jest was probably a bit uh, jarring um, and a bit of like an eye-opener as well because he's like winning this whole time and all of a sudden 
you're a bit behind in the st- the percent department. Yeah. Um, Shouts out to Grant, uh, my homeboy K. Thank you so much. Just must have finished the DJ set up over there, man. Really appreciate with the with you with the raid bringing on six people, man. Let me know, guys. What were you uh, What were you guys listening to last? I'm pretty sure he just finished up a DJ set over there on his Twitch TV and on his uh, Facebook Facebook gaming stream. Let me know, guys, uh, as you guys come through. The six people that just hopped in. We are right now in losers semis or quarters. We're in losers quarters. Let's take a look at the bracket really quickly for all of the people who are just now joining us. Yes, we are actually in losers quarters right now. We're watching Just Doki take on Swag Flu. Swag Flu just went up one nothing in this set. It's the best two out of three set. Solid uh, Hedgehog is waiting um, just beyond that, and then Luxray NYC. It was a Persona set. Okay, probably doing Persona every Thursday for the next three weeks. Wow, I didn't know you felt that. I didn't know you felt that good about Persona. <laughs> Nonetheless, man, appreciate you for coming by. Make sure to uh, check him out. Let me see if I can throw him up. Trail, thank you so much for the follow and the subscription. Let's go. Right. Probably got some gifted subscriptions coming on over there. Let me make sure I show you guys while I've got some time to make sure I copy and paste him in here. If you guys get a chance to, man, that was uh, gifted and uh, coming by from my homeboy K. I don't want to say people's real name on stream in case they don't want to <laughs> want everyone knowing that. But if you guys get a chance to, please be sure to check him out right here on Twitch.tv. X A G R A N D K, all one, all one word, right here on Twitch.tv. Be sure to check out his channel um, when you get a chance to. Amazing DJ provides sets uh, twice a week. If I'm not sure, make sure to let me know on that um, in the chat. I'll uh, make sure to uh, to uh, correct myself accordingly. But looks like we've got another game coming up, and let's go ahead and hop in the full game. Cherry, I'll let you take it away. Yeah, so we're seeing stick to Luigi here. I don't blame him, but at the same time, we'll see if Trell sticks to his game plan that he had kind of at the end of the game. We'll see, like, all right, so he's going with that dash tag in, getting that pretty aggressive start, and we might see him, yep, he's going to run back, be a bit patient, whereas he just do the same thing, trying to bait him into shielding for that grab, as you just saw, and he's going to go for it again, because it's kind of a 50-50 almost, like, as long as he runs behind it, you know that he's either going to either stop, wait for you to shield and grab, or he's going to not stop and go for a dash attack or down B or something. Kind of kind of funky. But um, we're seeing pretty even match start off uh, game two of this set. And uh, all right, up smash ledge guard. Nice. Weird way to stop the fire. But oh, oh, oh no. Yeah, that was so good on Trell's part, but... I, I can't believe that happened. That was so unfortunate. One of the small things that people may have a pet peeve if you're a Nest player about uh, these stages in particular is when you get that bounce off. Oh, mi misfire. Another misfire. Um, one of the pet peeves that you have as Ness is that on this stage, small battlefield, and it's variants battlefield and FD, uh, you actually can get the PK Thunder just stuck on the ledge like that. And yeah. It's unfortunate. But we'll see. He's a pretty behind, and ooh, that double nair. He could have gone for the uh, up B. He could have for the up B. Shot. Yep. Yeah. I've been waiting to see a cold cream today. Oh, that was smart. Walking the dog right there on the ledge. Yes, sir. Ooh, he's trying to go for that back throw. I think. Oh, oh, he might get it. Yep. Yeah, I think just might be in Trails' head a bit. Uh, in this one with that early stock deficit we're kind of seeing a bit of uh the plan from last game at the end go away we're seeing less uses of uh, those those uh giant disjoints with the multi-hits like dash attack and forward air and we're seeing more uses of grab pk fire and a couple other projectiles like his uh, up b and neutral b and you can't really afford to risk that like, you, yeah, sure, you're up again, Ooh, but... Ooh, just... Ooh. Losing the stock on the miss input right there. Yeah. Probably overshot with the uh, with the headbutt. Yeah. 
and I think that's definitely going to slow down just a bit. He might have been getting a bit confident in just how he was playing, trying to keep him at bay, tr keep Trell at bay. But now we're kind of seeing, ooh, those down tilts, that's scary stuff. Goes for jab, nice. Fireball, doesn't run up. Cold cram! There it is. There Hit it him is. with the cram. Alright, it's 1-1. One, one. That was quick. I don't know why, I don't know about you, but that felt pretty quick. That was quick. pretty fast, yes. Yeah, this was real good conditioning. So what he did essentially was he did throw out that fireball. Uh, and uh, basically the whole game, he was throwing him out, running and grabbing. And he did this last set too, waited. And so he was like, oh, it's free. It's fine to approach. So he throws out an aerial and just uh, shields it and goes for that up B. And the move, I think he used back air on, sh on uh, just Doki's shield. And back air for Ness, if you... Don't fast fall it. You get a bunch of landing lag, which essentially just means that you have so much. You, you're just a bit slow, and you can't really act out of it very much. And so Jess knew that was the case, and used that powerful upbeat to finish him off. So we'll see. See if we get any changes in this. We're knotted up at 1-1 one, one apiece, getting ready to go into the uh, next match. Um, just a quick reminder for everybody, this weekend we are going to be celebrating the Mamba Mentality Panel and NBA 2K21 Tournament. First place is $100, second place is $50, third is $25. It is free to enter if you get a chance to check out your passion first. Um, hop into our Discord so you guys can see the sign-up for that. And uh, you'll be able to get that sign-up and every tournament that we're going to be doing over the course of the next few weeks as well. Um, so yeah, if you guys get a chance to make sure to check us out there and if you need a quick reminder you can type exclamation point discord in the chat it does look like a stage switch is coming i think i wouldn't be surprised yeah i mean it honestly i think it's pretty cool when you do get to see a bunch come up because a lot of times people will say you'll see us at like more of a top level is that players will say well, just if you lost and it was close, stay on that stage because, like, if it was that close, then there's no, like, point in, like, worrying about it that much, you know? Yeah. But at the same time, like, the opponent might have won because they were on that stage and because they had just adapted a bit quicker than you. And switching it up might just Might give you, you, yeah, that change that you need, honestly. Yeah. It's, it's hard to – it's a weird choice to make. So it's all about – how confident you are in that pick and almost tricking yourself into just believing you'll do better with if you allow yourself to like pick you know but we'll see i'm not sure if any character switches are coming nothing was mentioned about switching so yeah that's what we're seeing is ness and luigi coming right back same size same place but guess what somebody's got to go home after this one let's hop into the full game All right, we're picking town and city. Town, definitely a wider stage. It's got uh, moving triplats that also are dual plats. And uh, they essentially, I don't remember how often the rotation starts, but there's three modes. There's the triplat mode, which it starts on. Then there is uh, only two platforms on the edges of the stage. Yeah. And then those go away, and it's just a single, single very Single middle, long. yep. Mm -hmm. And we'll see how this affects uh, the gameplay. I think that this might just benefit Trell a bit more, just due to the fact that it's just a larger stage. It gives him more uh, length to run away, as well as the fact that he doesn't have to worry about Luigi's fireballs always being within range. So he doesn't need to shield them. He can always heal if he's at, depending on where he's at. He can t afford to down B them, or he can afford to just run away and give up some stage pressure. Because because he's Ness, he can kind of afford to just jump over him and uses air mobility to his advantage. Now, he's got the percent lead. That stinks, he SDI'd out of that. Going for that nice, that DI mix-up. Doesn't tech that. Oh, goes for the side B. Honestly, might have wanted to grab there, but I'm not sure if that would have beaten out uh, down B anyways. Oh, and another DI mix-up on that. I think that at this point in the set, this is something that Trell's got to be aware of that Jess is doing. He's done it, I believe, all three games now at least once, is that this down air, uh, down throw in the down air. And 
he's got to start holding out in a way. So whether that means if he's on the left side when he gets down thrown, he's got to hold left. Cold Ooh. cram! There it is. And now I think this, that might have just sealed the deal is how quickly Jess is just piling on damage. And this is what I mean about Luigi is that he can kind of just... Um, ooh, nice. Good, good take of the stock. So yeah, he, no three stock happening there. No three stock indeed. Um, let's see. Go. Oh, he's kind of getting a little cocky with those um, down, those down throw the down bees. And I think, let's see. Nope, goes for back there. Trying to get that early down there. Goes for it, but doesn't commit. Down throw. Yep, there it is again. He's got. He's got to. He's got to adapt to that. He's got to hold out. Yeah, I think at this point in the game, the only way that, or one of the few ways that Trell can kind of come back from this is he's got to be very wary. Oh, never mind. No, you don't need to give any more. <laughs> <laughs> any more data. Just Doki awesome, with a great win going into loser semifinals. Yeah, it was kind of a risky uh choice on Jess's part, but I think it pays off. Jess, in the past, the couple times he's kind of done this kind of cheeky charge of his side B, he normally just holds it until it goes away, or releases it much sooner. And I think that time, just because of uh, the size of the stage, it kind of allowed Jess to release it just at the tip of the like full charge of it, and he was able to basically read the jump with that. So it was pretty smart, but also very risky in case um, um, Trell approach earlier. We're gonna keep this thing moving. We've got Solidus Hedgehog coming in to jump in against Jess Doki. Winner is gonna play Luxray NYC and lose his finals. This is another best two out of three matchup coming right here um, for all of the people that are just tuning in with us for our 29th edition of the It Doesn't Matter Who's Good or Who's Not. And it looks like um, Jess Doki's gonna do the striking first. Let's see what happens. All right, gets rid of Battlefield. Yeah, we, we have not seen we that. have not seen a lot of Battlefield. Period. Funny enough. Yeah. I think that one thing that a lot of players don't like about it is that a lot of characters um, just they really don't feel comfortable on that triplat. It doesn't necessarily benefit too.